views expressed on this program are those of the hosts, guests, and callers, and are not necessarily those of this station, its management, or other advertisers. You're listening to Transformation Talk Radio. Do you need assistance in discovering what you truly want in your life? Are you feeling unhappy and stuck and are clueless how to change that heavy feeling? The Laura Longley Show delivers powerful ways to work through common problems and stuck points. This fun and unique weekly show invites some of the most creative and transformative practitioners and authors, hypnotherapists, EFT practitioners, acupuncturists, and astrologers, among others, to activate your wildest dreams. Get ready to tune in to be more of who you truly are. Laura and her guests will take your calls and help you bring your brilliance to a greater brightness. Get ready to snap to a whole new level in your life with joy leading the way. Say yes to that inspired you and goodbye to your stuckness for good. Now, here is your host, Laura Longley. Good mid morning. I'm Laura Longley, and you're listening to the Laura Longley Show on T- Transformation Talk Radio. Stay with us for the next hour and let us help you experience ways to get unstuck and live an inspired life full of meaning, purpose, and happiness. Each week on the Laura Longley Show, we have some of the most gifted practitioners, speakers, and authors helping you to make authentic and lasting changes in your life. And it's the third Monday, and you know what that means. It's an all-call-in show. It's your chance to get some intuitive coaching or tarot guidance on an issue or problem that's been plaguing you. So now is the time to call. If you want to get some help with a problem you have, call in now at 800 930 2819. Again, it's 800 930 2819. And we can either do the tarot cards or I can just give you some intuitive advice. And I do want to remind you that I'd like for you to have a specific question, even if you want to do the tarot cards. So 800 930 2819. So, excuse me, while we're uh, waiting for people to call in, I want to share a few things that are going on for me right now. So I've got a lot of changes coming up in my business for the new year. And you may have noticed if you're on the mailing list that I've changed the name of my business from Blue Heron Wisdom to Your Authentic Wisdom. And that's primarily because lots of people didn't know what Blue Heron stood for, even though it is about authenticity. So I I chose a name that was a little bit more descriptive of what my business is about. In the past year, I really haven't been doing a whole lot in terms of seminars or workshops or teleseminars, and that's going to change come the first of the year. And so I'm updating the website right now to reflect what's going to be coming up in the new year. And All of the seminars and workshops and coaching that I'm going to do is really all about you getting in touch with your own authentic wisdom. And that doesn't mean that my focus has changed. It's just really zeroing in on everything that you need to make the changes in your life that you want, you already have within yourself. And it's really just up to me and the guests that are on the show to help you figure out how to get in touch with that wisdom. So the focus is going to be on, first of all, the first level is change because we don't do anything unless we're feeling stuck and in pain. So the first step is how do I start to shift? And then the next step is around authentic happiness, bringing more happiness into your life that comes from within. And then the third step is authentic life where you're really delving deep into who you are as a person to discover your own authenticity and bring that to your life throughout the day, throughout the month, throughout the years. And then some, some, uh, Other programs I'm going to be doing that are related but can be standalone sorts of things are authentic career, and I have done a lot of career coaching over the last five years, and so it's just tweaking what I've already been doing to really make it clear that this is about the wisdom you have inside authentically to bring to your career. And the other 
is authentic business. So same thing. If you have been thinking you need a shift in your life and you've been thinking about starting a business, really getting in touch with what resonates for you authentically is going to be one of the programs that I'm going to be rolling out early in the year next year. So we we still have callers, uh, or rather lines open for callers for tarot reading or intuitive guidance at 800 930 2819. So if you've got a question you'd like a little bit of help with, you can give a call right now at 800-930-2819. And one of the things that I've done in support of this shift to your authentic wisdom is I put together a report that has the top five ways for you to get unstuck right now. So this is if you really are in a place where you just know that you're not where you want to be, you're really unhappy, and you're feeling a little bit like, I don't know what in the world to do to shift this. This report gives you five things that you can do right now that are going to start a shift in your life. And you can get it by going to the website. You can either go to the lauralongleyshow.com and you'll see in the banner at the very top of the page is the sign up for the free report. Or you can go to yourauthenticwisdom.com. And again, in the banner at the top of the page, you'll see the sign up to get this report that will help you start getting unstuck right now. And we all need when we're in that stuck place to really begin to make the shift because staying stuck, um, well, number one, nothing changes, right? And if you're feeling stuck, usually we apply that word stuck to meaning we're not happy with where we are in our lives and we don't know how to make a shift. And so this will give you five tools that you can start applying right away that are guaranteed to start making a shift in your life. So if you do these things, and they're not hard, they're simple things. If you do these things, they are going to create a shift in your life. Now, the other thing that's going to be coming up, and I I don't have it set up just yet, but I will have it set up by the first of the year, is there's going to be 30 days of change where you can sign up for the month of January, actually, I guess that's 31 days in January, you can sign up to get every day in your email inbox a tip or a tool about something you can do that day that will make a shift in your life. And, you know, I I recognize that not every single one of these things that come out every day for 31 days are going to resonate for everybody. But that's the beauty of it being every day for 31 days. You'll find plenty of them that do resonate for you. And the other thing is I'll also be putting out 52 weekly practices. So those are going to be more in-depth practices for you to use throughout the year beginning in January. So keep your eye out on the website for those. Those will be up by the end of the year so that you can get started in January with those. And again, the The lines are open for callers for tarot readings or intuitive guidance, 800-930-2819. And I really would love to talk to some of you today. So I'd really love to get some callers in so that we can talk about some of the things that are going on right now can be a really difficult time of the year for people in general with the holidays. And so if you've got a holiday issue that's going on, I'd love to hear from you and give you a little bit of support with that. But it doesn't have to be a holiday issue. Anything that you need some guidance on, 800-930-2819. And while we're waiting for people to call in, I'm going to dive right into talking about the five tips that you're going to learn about in this free report on the website so that you can hear a little bit about what these things are that you can do to begin right away making a shift in your life. And the very first one is, and again, all of these are simple. They're they're very simple concepts. Now, sometimes they aren't easy to apply because they take effort for us to do something different than we've been doing. But the very first one, and it's at the top of the list, because you have to do this before you can make any change in your life. And that is for you to accept the reality of what is going on for you right now, 
that you don't like. Because a lot of times when we are stuck in a place where we are unhappy, we don't like what's happening, we don't like the situation or circumstances, we try and deny it from the perspective of we'll say, this shouldn't be happening to me, or I should be doing this, or I should be getting that. And whenever we start saying something shouldn't be the way it is, we're denying what really is happening. We're denying the truth. And there's a saying that you may have heard, what you resist persists. So if you're resisting acknowledging or accepting that you are in the situation that you're in by having all these reasons that you shouldn't be in this situation or that it's unfair or, or whatever you're telling yourself that is not accepting the situation, you are just perpetuating it because what happens is you're focused on why it shouldn't be the way it is. But the reality is it is that way. So what you need to do is begin accepting this is the way it is. And the very first thing you will find once you start working on accepting, and it will be a practice to do that, it won't come naturally, you'll have to be very conscious of it. But the first thing you'll find is that already you're going to start feeling happier. Because what happens is that you're going to shift your attention from all the reasons why this shouldn't be happening to you or all the excuses around why it's not your fault or all the blame around why it's somebody else's fault. And you're going to be letting go of the focus on why this is a bad thing. And then that's going to free you up to start looking at, okay, this is what is real. Now, what do I want to do about it? So that's the very first step, step is to accept the reality of your situation. And we are coming up here on time for us to take a break. And again, the lines are open if you want to have an on-air tarot reading or if you'd like to just get some intuitive guidance around a problem that you're having in your life, you can call in at 800 930 right now. Again, that's 800 800- Nine three zero two eight one nine. I'm Laura Longley, and you're listening to the Laura Longley Show, where authentic change takes flight. You can find me on Facebook at the Laura Longley Show and at the Show dot com. Stay tuned, and we'll be right back. Every bed is full with the both of us. This house. Are you feeling stuck? Do you want to be free from fears and doubts, and finally feel good about yourself? But you just don't know how to get there? Dr. Schaub's Accelerated Breakthrough Program provides you with the tools and solutions to go beyond your limitations and achieve self-empowered confidence. Call for your free phone consultation at 866-903-MIND. Visit CellularWisdom.com. That's CellularWisdom.com. Tune in to Peace World Radio, vibrant conversations to change the world with Christina Jans. Each second Monday at 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern Time on TransformationTalkRadio.com and KKNW. This hit show is energetic, vibrant, and an engaging forum that's getting people talking. Christina brings you extraordinary and courageous people, bold in thought, and action who dare to dream that things can be different. Peace World Radio. Join the talk. The world is happy. Laura Longley is on a mission to remove stuckness from your life for good and replace it with happiness. Tune in Mondays at 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern, and Tuesdays at 1 p.m. Pacific, 4 p.m. Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com for The Laura Longley Show, where authentic change takes flight. Say yes to that inspired you and goodbye to your stuckness as Laura and her guests deliver powerful ways to work through common problems in this fun and unique hit show. What if the world doesn't function the way we've been told? What if we truly can bend the laws of physical reality? What if we can end limitation? What if weird were the coolest thing you could be? And what if it's time for a totally different reality? Are you ready to create it? Are you ready to dream as big as you dare? Hi, my name is Dane here. 13 years ago, I started to truly ask questions. Actually, I started to be the question, and everything in my life changed for me. This is your invitation to step into something that Einstein, Marie Curie, Newton, Da Vinci, Shakespeare, Gandhi, Galileo, and Aristotle all knew to be true. It's not about the answer. It's about being the question. 
always. It's about truly being you, whatever that looks like, and changing this world. Is now the time? Start by signing up for a free video series at beingyouclass.com. That's beingyouclass.com. What if you are the gift and the change this world requires? Being you, you are the gift and the change this world requires. Beingyouclass.com. Tune in to The Truth is Funny with Colette Stephan each Wednesday at 8 a.m. Pacific, 11 a.m. Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com. This hit show will have you thinking outside the box and riding the wave of infinite potential. Join Colette on the Higher Self Network, inspiring listeners to shine their brilliance and ensure success while roaring with laughter as they recognize the humor of the giant cosmic joke. Visit thetruthisfunny.com. We're back on the Laura Longley Show, and it's the third Monday, so we're doing an all-call-in show where you're going to have the opportunity to have some intuitive coaching or a tarot reading around an issue in your life. You can call in right now at 800-930-2819, and uh, just let Benny know what's on your mind and what you'd like a little bit of help with. Again, it's 800-930-2819 and the lines are open. There is no waiting. So I would really love to have some of you call in and have a little chat. So let's, uh, let's get those phone lines going at 800-930-2819. So before the break, I was talking with you about what the tools are, the five simple tools that are in this report that you can get by going to the website at which is yourauthenticwisdom.com or the lauralongleyshow.com and up in the uh, banner at the top of the page you'll find the sign up for the report and so the first one is accept your reality and I talked a little bit before the break um, maybe a lot before the break about why that is important but that really is the first step whether you are in a place of having no clue of what you want to create and you're just feeling incredibly stuck and unhappy or whether you know what you want but you just don't know how to get it the very first step is this one of accepting reality Uh, the next tool and these don't have to be done in a particular order necessarily except for accept your reality really does have to come first and the next tool is one that is really great whether you know what you want to create or don't know what you want to create and that is asking questions of the universe and it can help you really get clarity on what it is that you want when you feel stuck and you don't even know what direction to go because you can start asking questions like Why is it so easy for me to know what I want? And that just opens up for the universe to come back and show you clarity on what you want. So you can ask those kinds of questions even when you don't know what it is that you want. And if you do know what it is that you want, then you can start asking questions that will move you in that direction, such as, uh, why is it so easy for me to take the first step in this new direction. So those kinds of questions can really help you get unstuck and start moving forward. And I'm going to stop at this point because I think we have a caller. Yeah, we'll go ahead and take Robin calling in from Kirkland. Robin, welcome to the Laura Longley Show. What's up? Hi, Robin. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning, Laura. (laughs) How are you? I'm good. good. I'm so excited I called in. Well, I'm so excited you called in, too, because, you know, lots of times we have, you know, plenty of callers. And today, for some reason, it's very, very quiet. And I love to take calls. So so how can I help you? I love it. Um, I'm actually a a single mom of a little four-year-old. And I've been in sort of an on-again, off-again love relationship with not her father, but just with my boyfriend. Uh Uh-huh. And I just feel like that relationship has really run its course, has really run its course, and I feel ready to move on. Mm-hmm. Um, and I, you know, I have this little sort of wish or vision board <laughs> out there of someone that would embrace not only me, but my daughter as well, and sort of complete that family unit right. I, I was really hopeful for. So I'm just wondering if there's something I can do to sort of bring that space in and 
clear. I absolutely care about the person I've been doing this on again, off again thing with, mm-hmm. but I just don't see it going further. Right. And and I do have that sort of nuclear family vision in my future, and I just want to know what can I do to help bring that in and, and sort of lovingly clarify this one out and bring in that new space for me and my daughter. Okay. So I will say even before I, I pull a card that um, – Obviously, I'm sure you already know this, you really have to complete the on again, off again before something else will show up. I totally get it. Yeah. I totally get it. So so what is keeping you from doing that? Oh, you know, on Facebook when they say it's complicated. Yes. <laughs> but, but to try, <laughs> it's complicated to try and uncomplicate it. Um, I can't believe I'm saying this out loud in public. Uh the person I'm with who I care a ton for has a wife who has Alzheimer's. Uh-huh. So he's sort of in an incomplete place and is okay. always going to care for that person. And right. she's got full-time care, et cetera. And there couldn't be a more loving person. If he was fully available, mm-hmm. we've even talked about, you know, being married and all that kind of stuff. Right. But I just, I, my gut's telling me that's never going to happen. And I'm not trying to make light of it and, Right. And again, I, I care about her, the wife as well. Mm-hmm. So it's just this awkward sort of situation. Right. And we own a house together, he and I. So oh. the house that I live in with my daughter, we own it together. So I've actually even considered if I just could make a clean break, I might sell the home in the spring. There's equity. It's a great house. But I might have to take, I don't know if that's the most drastic step I have to take to make that break. And okay. I, I feel like my gut tells me, it would be smart to make that kind of break really mm-hmm. clean. And at the same time, you know, moving a four-year-old and all my possessions and blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so right. there's my blah, blah. Okay, so <laughs> I, I am going so to ask for a card just around completing that relationship. And Great. if you if you've heard me done this, do this before, you know that I ask, what, what does Robin need to know or where does Robin need to yes. focus in order to you know, make this as easy as possible and really the best possible way for everybody involved. For everyone involved. Yeah. yeah. All right. So uh, what we have is uh, the 14 in the major arcana, which is art. And it's really about alchemy. And Mm -hmm. so... I, what I feel like this is saying is that it's really kind of about through an alchemic process transforming this relationship that you have into something uh-huh. different. And uh-huh. so that that makes me wonder maybe it isn't supposed to be a complete break. And so uh-huh. maybe you can think about how what what kind of relationship you could continue to have with this man uh-huh. that would not then interfere with you bringing in this other type of relationship that you really want? Uh-huh. There's a lot. There's, I mean, definite soul connection here to our families. Mm-hmm. And I have a deep caring for, for his wife as well, even though she's, yes. you know, she's got a foot in another place. Right. Um, yeah, he's such, he's a great person. I, I probably would have never even entertained the thought. We've been friends for years. We've known each other for years. It's just awkward to find a way to, to shift back into that friendship place without, I don't want him to feel rejected. Right. And right. at the same time, he can't show up 100% for us when he's still caring for this other person, right. which is absolutely what I'd want him to do. So. Right. Yeah, it's, I'm on a weird tightrope. <laughs> yeah. So so that's something that I would just say to meditate on. And, yeah. you know, I was just, mm-hmm. just before you called in, I was talking about asking questions of the universe. And that's something that you can ask a question of the universe as kind of a spiritual practice around yeah. what what else is possible in this situation. And just leave Good. that open. What else is possible? What what can happen that is for the best of everybody involved? Good. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely. It's been in my meditation quite a bit lately. <laughs> right. And, you know, I've really just grown to love this idea of asking the questions because 
I don't have to know the answer. <laughs> and For, I can right? just Thank leave you. it open. Yeah. And say, okay, what else is possible? And, yeah. you know, how can it get better than this? Just leaving those oh, that's open my questions. Question. Yeah. I like it. How can it get better than this? Because right now it's not bad. Right. Um, I I just know that my daughter and I want somebody full time and more interactive with us. So right. how do we make that happen and keep everybody happy? <laughs> exactly. And yeah. And so you just ask that question every day or multiple days and I mean, multiple sure. times a day and see what happens. Now, do you want to ask about drawing in another relationship or does it feel like you need to resolve this first? Um, like I said, it's, it's so complicated. I should just get a reading with you on a different <laughs> time, but, um, because I feel like I've got all these different webs that connect. And I think all of us feel that from time to time, yeah. you can't change one thing in a vacuum right. without the domino effect happening in other places. Mm-hmm. And, and, um, I, I definitely come from that spirit like you of, of what's the highest and best for all of us. Right. At the same time, I think because I'm the tree in the forest, I can't see the whole forest. I don't feel like I have yes. a map um, that I can look at objectively because I've got all these emotions swirling around it. So, so, so I guess I just, keep, you know, keep on with my meditation, yes. keep asking the questions, you know, listening to the radio, taking yep. a chance and calling in. Things like that are happening to help me sort of figure out the stepping stones. Oh, right. Absolutely. Yep. So, yeah. So the focus being on how do you transform this current relationship into something different that is yeah. in the highest and best for everybody. I would love that. I don't want to not be connected to their family and, and they mean a lot to me. So it would be great if I could find a way to peacefully without hurting anybody, including me. Right. You know, transition this into something really positive and allow something else to come in and, and have that side so be okay with it. Absolutely. Yeah, exactly. Indeed. Okay. Well, thank you so much thank for your you. call, and I wish you all the best. I appreciate you. All right. Thank, thank, thank you, so Robin. Much. Okay. Bye-bye. So we're taking on-air calls for tarot readings at 800-930-2819. So give a call if you have a question or an issue that you'd like some help with. And in the meantime, we're going to take a break. I'm Laura Longley, and you're listening to The Laura Longley Show, where authentic change takes flight. You can find me on Facebook at The Laura Longley Show and at thelauralongleyshow.com. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. Tune in to The Jen Royster Show, intuitive guidance to inspire your life, each Thursday at 8 a.m. Pacific and 11 a.m. Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com. This amazing show is an inspirational hour that will take you on an epic metaphysical journey to discover the spiritual approach to life's greatest challenges. Dr. Jen is an internationally known intuitive counselor, spiritual teacher, and energy healer. Call in for intuitive readings and visit JenRoyster.com for more information. Are you ready to give your home a fresh look but don't want to do the work? Help is a phone call away. Kathy's Handy is a full-service general contracting company specializing in home improvement, remodeling, and repairs. Kathy's Handy are specialists in kitchens, baths, fireplace makeovers, and finished carpentry, and they partner with other amazing specialty subcontractors needed to complete any job. Friendly, energetic, and dependable with an impeccable reputation to get the job done while keeping you as comfortable as possible during the transformation of your home is the hallmark of Kathy's Handy. Call Kathy now for a free estimate. 206-715-8126. That's 206-715-8126. And visit Kathy'sHandy.com for a complete view of possibilities for your home. Called the Oprah of Radio by her listeners. Award-winning host Dr. Pat Basile is blowing the doors off of traditional talk radio. Get ready for an energizing delivery and powerful interviews with leaders in the field of human potential. Dr. Pat's fresh new perspective on living life full out has catapulted her show to the top of talk radio. Tune in and Dr. Pat will help you thrive instead of merely survive. Visit the drpatshow.com. That's T-H-E-D-R-Pat-Show.com for listening times in your area. 
Tune in each Wednesday at noon Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com for the hit show Out of the Fog with Karen Hager. Spark your spirit and ignite your soul with spiritual conversation and enlightening guests that will help catapult you into action. You'll meet metaphysical movers and shakers and light workers guaranteed to raise your vibration. Karen's down-to-earth style and lively curiosity is what makes this show super special. Visit FogCityPsychic.com to find out more and to book your private intuitive reading today. Get inspired. Create the life you desire with internationally known radio host and motivational speaker, Sue London. Sue inspires millions of people to overcome difficult or traumatic situations in their lives. People feel hope, courage, and are ready to move forward after hearing Sue speak. Book motivational speaker Sue London for your next event at AskSueLondon.com. That's AskSueLondon.com. When Christmas Day is here, the most wonderful day of the year. We're back on the Laura Longley Show, and it's the third Monday which means it's an all-call-in show where you have a chance to get some intuitive coaching or tarot guidance around a problem or issue that's bothering you. You can call in now at 800-930-2819, and we do have a caller. We have... Mary from Seattle. Great. Thanks, Benny. Hi, Mary. Hello. Thank you for taking my call. You bet. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. Very good. So what can I help you with? Well, I three weeks ago, I had um, total knee replacement surgery. Wow. Um, which I'm doing really well. I'm walking on my own. And, Good. I'm um, doing my exercises diligently and everything. Good for you. <laughs> <laughs> That's, movement is what counts. Anybody out there about to go through this, do the exercises and, um, and move. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I am going to go back to work here soon. Mm-hmm. And I think there's some new opportunities coming for me, and I just wanted to check in and see um, if those would play out or not. So in, in terms of around a different opportunity for work? Um, yes, at, at the same place, uh-huh. but in a different, in a kind of a different area. Okay, so, so I can't predict the future, but what I can sure. do is I can um, ask about... What, um, you know, what do you, what do you need to know about opportunities that are going to show up when you go back to work? So when do you go back? Um, probably in about three weeks. Okay. So after the new year. Right. Well, well, that'll be a nice kind of segue into new year, (laughs) new work. (laughs) All right. So let's see what we have come up here for us. Okay, I I love this. This is one of my favorite cards. It's the Prince of Wands, and Wands is the suit of spirit, and the Prince of Wands in particular is about inspiration. And he's about, <clears throat> well, the picture on the card in the, the deck that I use is he's in a chariot with a, a lion pulling the chariot, and it's like all the, it, they aren't flames per se, but it looks like all these flames shooting out. Mm-hmm. And so it's very active and very... um Oh, I don't know what the right word is, but but it is about inspiration. And it feels to me always really exciting. And so that's what it seems to me is okay. what it's saying about you for your opportunities, your new opportunities. So is that kind of your sense of things that there's going to be something new that you're going to be excited about? I think so. I, I'm going to be in a whole different location even i mean my my place the place will be totally totally different from where i'm at right now Uh i'll I'll be doing some of the same types of things but it's going to be the same yet different i i don't know if that makes too much sense no i I know what you're saying but maybe in a different context right yeah right right exactly so it'll Um, make it new Right. That's and that's what I'm so looking forward to. Uh yeah, because it, it can get kind of boring over time sometimes. Uh right. <laughs> yeah. Well it does right. sound well, I I mean to me this card is saying that it is gonna be whether it's new or, or not new, whether it's the same, it, there's gonna be a different level of inspiration on your part with okay. it. Okay. 
Yeah. Great. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you very much. Well, thank you for calling and uh, good luck with your knee. And I'm so proud of you for doing your exercises. I don't know how good I'd be at that. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, you know, it, after you, you do them, it doesn't hurt so much. Oh. It, it actually feels better. So that's a, a good um, incentive. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mary. Okay. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. And we have another caller. Sure. Let's stay in the local area of Seattle, and we'll uh, bring on Katie now. Katie, welcome to the Laura Longley Show. Hi, Katie. Thank you. Hi. How are you? I'm well, thank you. And you? Very good. I I am well. At, I'm well as well. <laughs> That's wonderful. <laughs> so so what, um, what can I help you with today? Well, I just wonder if I'll ever meet someone okay. <laughs> in my life. Okay. <laughs> Oh, it's a typical, you know, I've been out of relationships for a long time, and mm-hmm. I'm, I'm fearful. I'm, I'm afraid. So are you doing anything actively to meet people? Um, yes and no. Okay. <laughs> I, so I have, what does that mean? Well, winter makes it a little harder for me to be motivated to go out and do right. stuff, I guess. But, um, yeah. Well, okay, so I'm going to ask my typical question, which is, what does Katie need to know or what does Katie need to focus on to bring into her life the relationship that she wants? Okay. All right. So let's see what uh-huh. what comes up for us here. Okay. All right. Let's see. Okay. So what came up is the eight of discs, which is prudence. Uh-huh. And... Uh-huh. Discs are the suit of the physical world and, you know, being kind of grounded. And, of course, prudence is almost about being cautious, right? It's about kind of doing your due diligence and, um, you know, proceeding carefully. Uh So it it seems to me that perhaps what's going on for you – so. So are you feeling like you're not feeling all that motivated or in the past you just haven't been very successful in finding what you're looking for? Both. Both. Okay. Okay. So what I think that this is saying is that this is a time for not not caution in terms of being fearful. And uh-huh. we can talk a minute because I know you said you are a little bit fearful. Um, yeah. But but more in terms of being really grounded and mm. just taking your time, not being yeah. in a hurry. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So, that makes so, sense. So say a little bit about what you're fearful about. Is it just because you haven't been in a relationship for a while? That as well as I'm very independent, so I have a fear of, um, giving away too much of myself, right. which I always have in the past. Uh-huh. I can and relate to that. I'm miserable. Yes. Yeah. So I guess I'm just wondering if it'll ever happen for me. Mm-hmm. Like, part of me doesn't believe it. Part of me is like, oh, I guess it's okay if I don't find someone. You know, it's kind of tough. Well, I think Between. that perhaps you have a belief that is, if I don't give myself away, nobody will want me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sure. So if I continue to be who I am and have my own needs and mm-hmm. sometimes my own demands, nobody's going to mm-hmm. want to put up with that. Uh-huh. Yes. So so those are some beliefs to work on because okay. they, you can look around and find evidence in other people, couples that you may know, where mm-hmm. they are supportive of mm-hmm. what the other person wants. Right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And, um, so I would say that working on those beliefs is going to be key to you being able to find the kind of relationship that you want, because as long as at a deep level that you believe that nobody's going to want you, if you're not willing to give up yourself, then that's all you're going to find is people who Uh only want you if you're willing to give up yourself, right? That makes perfect sense. Yes, it really does. And and then this this card around prudence is also a way to proceed when you meet somebody so that you can, so if you go slowly enough, then you're going to be more conscious and noticing 
if you're starting to lean towards giving up more than is really what you want to give up. Okay. Okay. That makes perfect sense. Yeah. yeah. And so, and it, it so you can keep it in balance. I'm sorry. Hmm? It I'm has sorry. a lot to do with my self-confidence, I think, as well. Yes. You know, I have a lot of self-doubt, so I need to work on that. Well, yeah, I think that we all have that to to varying degrees and at varying times in our lives. But, yeah, it's yeah. working on those beliefs that um, that are really kind of um, thwarting what you want. So how would I go about that? Would I meditate or? Yes. Yeah. Meditation okay. is great. Um, you know, I've been really banging the drum about these asking questions of the universe, but I, uh-huh. I love it. I've, I've been doing it for a couple months now and I have gotten such great results myself. So you oh. could, so you could ask a question or questions of the universe and one of them might be, and this is actually one of mine because your <laughs> issue is my issue <laughs> is oh my. why, why am I so loved just for being me? Uh, okay. And so okay. then people start showing up in your life that love you just for you. You don't have to do things for them. You don't have to change how you are for them. They love uh-huh. you just for you. And and another one that I use that's related to that is why am I so lovable? Oh, okay. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> and so, you know, start looking at other kinds of questions that, would help to shift those beliefs that you have. Oh, wonderful. I so appreciate that. Now I'll I'll start working on that. Yeah. (laughs) And and it's easy to do and you don't even have to know the answer. You just wait for the universe to give you the answer. This is why you are so lovable because these people love you. So. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. I didn't know it was that simple. (laughs) Yeah, it is. (laughs) You don't do the work. The universe does the work. I like that. Great. Well, thank you so very much for the, uh, letting me talk with you and have a happy holiday. You bet you too. And thanks for your call, Katie. Okay, bye. All right, bye bye. So we're taking calls today for tarot readings and intuitive guidance at 800-930-2819. The lines are open right now. We're going to take a quick break. So give a call in on the break if you want to get in before the end of the show. I'm Laura Longley, and you're listening to The Laura Longley Show, where authentic change takes flight. We'll be right back. Jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bell swing and jingle bells ring. Snowing and blowing. Fun. Now the jingle hop has begun. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bell. Laura Longley is on a mission to remove stuckness from your life for good and replace it with happiness. Tune in Mondays at 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern, and Tuesdays at 1 p.m. Pacific, 4 p.m. Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com for The Laura Longley Show, where authentic change takes flight. Say yes to that inspired you and goodbye to your stuckness as Laura and her guests deliver powerful ways to work through common problems in this fun and unique hit show. Tune in to the Sandy Brewer Show, getting to the heart of what matters in your life. Thursdays at 1 p.m. Pacific, 4 p.m. Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com and experience the powerful healing voice of Dr. Sandy Brewer, one of Call and Talk Radio's most dynamic, compelling personalities. Get ready for inspiration and contagious humor and her been there, done that, no-nonsense advice to meet today's challenges. Listen and call in at 800-930-2819 for the Sandy Brewer Show. The Tick-Borne Disease Alliance, TBDA, has just launched Bite Back for a Cure, a new national grassroots campaign to build support for the fight against tick-borne diseases. This fall, 24-year-old John Donnelly is biking across America to meet others affected by tick-borne diseases and raise awareness about the national tick-borne disease epidemic. TBDA wants you to get involved in the campaign and follow John's journey. To learn more, visit BiteBackForACure.org. Tune in to Peace World Radio, vibrant conversations to change the world with Christina Jans each second Monday at 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern Time on TransformationTalkRadio.com and KKNW. This hit show is energetic, vibrant, and an engaging forum that's getting people talking. Christina brings you extraordinary and courageous people, bold in thought and action who dare to dream that things can be different. Peace World Radio, join the talk. 
the world is happening. Tune in each Tuesday at noon Pacific and 3 Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com for The Dr. Julie Show, All Things Connected with Dr. Julie Kroll, featuring weekly segments with David Eisen and the Chakra Sound System. Each week, you will journey through infinite possibilities, expand into social potential, and find beautiful beginnings where endings leave off. Change makers from around the world will explore what's emergent about the environment, relationships, health, the arts, education, and the evolution of consciousness. Visit the thedrjulieshow.com. ACT, Advanced Cell Training, is a restorative healing process created by Gary Blyer to address the body malfunctions that contribute to illness. This breakthrough learning program teaches health insights and principles, strategic integration of both traditional and alternative modalities, while clients train their own bodies to heal themselves. Visit AdvancedCellTraining.com. That's AdvancedCellTraining.com. We're back on the Laura Longley Show, and it's the third Monday, which means that it's an all-call-in show where you get a chance to get some tarot guidance or intuitive coaching, and we have time for one more call before the end of the show. If you call right now, 800-930-2819. No waiting, 800-930-2819. I'd love to talk with one more person before the end of the show. And while we're waiting for someone to call in to be our last caller of the day. I'm going to talk a little bit more about what's in this free report on my website at yourauthenticwisdom.com. And so what we've already talked about in terms of simple ways that you can start to shift your life, shift situations you don't like. The first thing is accepting your reality. The second thing is asking questions of the universe, which is my new favorite thing to do. And I find it very powerful. Another thing that you can do if you're one of those people who is feeling really stuck and just miserable, but you have no idea what it is that you want to create. So you don't know what direction you want to go. You just know you don't like where you are. Do something it is that you want to create. So you don't know what direction you want to go. You just know you don't like where you are. Do something different. Change one small thing and it doesn't have to be related. And actually it's fine and actually better if it's not even related to what your issue is. So something like uh, making a sandwich a different way than you usually do. So if you usually put the cheese next to the bread, put the cheese in the middle of the sandwich. Um, other things you could do would be, you know, t- drive a different way to work. One day you could go to a grocery store or a coffee shop that is not the one that you usually go to. And the reason that you want to do these things is because it creates new neural pathways in your brain. When you, when you do something by rote, like drive the same route to work every single day, uh, your brain has, has uh, dug in this neural pathway. And when you create new neural pathways, it opens up your creativity in a different way. And that will lead you to starting to have a shift in your life. And we do have a caller for the last part of the show here. I'm excited to talk to Sarah from Tacoma. Hi, Sarah. Hi. Thank you so much for taking my call. Well, I'm um, glad that you called in. How can I help you? Well, I wondered, uh, are you um, doing the tarot cards today? I am doing the tarot cards today. Is there anything that comes up um, for love in my life? So, So tell me just briefly about what your situation is right now. Well, you know, I've been out of a relationship for about three and a half years, and I am just me and my daughter, and I've, you know, given it time. I haven't dated, I haven't done anything, and yet I think that I've kind of prepared me and us for um, inviting someone new into our lives. And so you're feeling like it's time. I do. Okay. So so what I'm going to ask is my kind of standard question, which is what does Sarah need to know or where does Sarah need to focus in order to invite in the relationship she wants? Okay. All right. And let's see what we have come up here for us. Okay. We, we have the Prince of Discs. We're getting a lot of the royalty cards today. Um, and Discs is the suit of the physical world. And 
the Prince, because you might have heard me talk earlier in the show, someone else got the Prince of Wands. Uh And so the Prince is always about moving forward. And he's in a chariot. And in this particular card in the discs, it's a bull that's pulling the chariot with the, the other one. It's a lion. And this one is feels a lot more grounded because it's this physical feeling to things, the physical world, the physical manifestation. And what this feels like to me is that for you, you're going to want to do this in a very, what's the word I want, you know, you know, kind of not structured, but deliberate, you want to be very deliberate Uh about this. And so being very clear on what kind of a relationship you want, what kind of a person you want. So huh? so getting very clear on those very physical kinds of things of what it's going to look like in your life. So this is different than the Prince of Wands where it's all about this inspiration and this fire. And blah. This is very deliberate. And, you know, it's kind of like setting out intentions uh-huh. even writing intentions of what what this looks like for you, what this relationship looks like. So do you feel like you have a good idea of that, or is you that know, some work? I do, I do, and I actually have written it down in oh, a good. list. Very good. And then I had a dream last night, and it was like this ideal person, and, you know, for me it's just something that is easy and, nat- easy and natural yep. and not forced. Mm-hmm. And... Um, yeah, so so I, I do have it written down. I do a lot of writing in that way, and really, I think it's about it's about time. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, you know, hearing that you've already written it down, I think yeah. that this card is really just validating that approach oh, that you've gotten clear on what it is that you want. And you know, the only thing that I would say is that. You know, we want to be cautious that a list does not become like a shopping list, Sure. you know, but but basically that it really is more like bringing clarity of in general what you want. And okay. yeah, so you don't have to have a checklist. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yes, that this, makes sense. Is that right? <laughs> good, good. Well, good. This, this helps me. I appreciate that. It gives me some hope. And thanks so well, much. Well, very good. And thank you for calling, Sarah. Uh, bye-bye. All right, thanks. So uh, that was a great call for us to wrap up our show today. And we had a couple on relationships and another one on jobs. And so it was kind of fun to have a few different topics that we talked about. So before we wrap up here, there are a couple of things that I want to share with you. I want to remind you that you can get this free report because I didn't get a chance to get through all of the five tools for shifting your life for getting unstuck so you can get it at the lauralongleyshow.com up in the banner at the top of the page you'll see the sign up for that and you'll get a pdf document right away as soon as you sign up for it <clears throat> so that's where you can find that and then i also wanted to uh get get my papers in a row so that i could find what it is i also wanted to tell you about oh i know what i wanted to tell you about I'm going to be sitting in for Dr. Pat on Thursday this week at noon Pacific time, 3 p.m. Eastern, which is not a time that I'm usually doing a show. So I just wanted to let you know about that. And that will be on both KKNW and WBLQ, as well as Transformation Talk Radio. On our Facebook page this week, this week, this month, we're focusing on the holidays, not from the perspective of Christmas, but from the perspective of what what are the holidays about? So it's about love for ourselves and for other people. Would love to have you join us on Facebook. There's always different tools and conversations going on there each day. So I want to thank all of the callers that were brave enough to call in and ask for help and guidance because I know that it sometimes can be a little bit scary to call, especially if you haven't done it before. And I want to thank you all for tuning into the Laura Longley Show today with me, Laura Longley. I had a very good time, as I always do. Please join me every Monday 
at 2 p.m. Eastern, 11 a.m. Pacific on KKNW in Seattle or TransformationTalkRadio.com. And every Tuesday at 4 p.m. Eastern, 3 p.m. Central, and 1 p.m. Pacific on TransformationTalkRadio.com. Tomorrow at 1 p.m. Pacific, I'll be talking with author Tom Oliver about his new book, Nothing is Impossible. And on Thursday, as I mentioned, I'll be filling in for Dr. Pat at noon Pacific, 3 p.m. Eastern. And on that show, I'll be talking with Sue Elliott, who is the editor of The Law of Attraction magazine. And we're going to be talking about reducing stress for the holidays. And Sue has a free MP3 that she's going to be giving away about that topic. So be sure to tune in to get that free MP3. And it's for everybody. It's not just for the first caller or whatever. And Sue's also going to be taking calls and using a clearing process that she's developed that will help to ensure that your holiday is stress-free. Have a joyous day, and I'll see you back here next time. You've been listening to The Laura Longley Show, where authentic change takes flight. Tune in each Tuesday on TransformationTalkRadio.com at 1 p.m. Pacific Time, 4 p.m. Eastern Time, and on KKNW every Monday at 11 a.m. Pacific Time, 2 p.m. Eastern Time, and everywhere on TransformationTalkRadio.com. Join Laura and her friends as they help you create the life that you truly deserve. For more information about Laura, her services, and amazing tools, visit TheLauraLongleyShow.com. Laura Longley is on a mission to remove stuckness from your life for good and replace it with happiness. Tune in Mondays at 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern, and Tuesdays at 1 p.m. Pacific, 4 p.m. Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com for The Laura Longley Show, where authentic change takes flight. Say yes to that inspired you and goodbye to your stuckness as Laura and her guests deliver powerful ways to work through common problems in this fun and unique hit show. There is not just one kind of radio show. Some radio shows are all about busting through and getting unstuck from the crust in your life. But the Dr. Pat Show? Well, she does it all. She's been helping people in all aspects of their life now for 10 years. Her interview style, her unique personality, the amazing guests she has on her show are all factors of what makes an amazing radio show. Please join Dr. Pat in celebrating 10 extraordinary years of talk radio. Hi, I'm Dr. Pat. Thank you for supporting us for the past 10 years. We are promising each and every one of you that this coming year, our 10th year anniversary, will be the best yet. We will be paying forward so many ideas, so many tools, so many gifts to all of you because you have inspired us to be better and better and better each year. For more information, please make sure you stay tuned to TransformationTalkRadio.com or the TheDrPatShow.com. And remember, join me. Let's live life full out together. Tune in each Thursday at 9 a.m. Pacific, noon Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com for the hit radio show that illuminates the heart-centered bond of animal and human as souls destined to find each other in a lifetime. Each week, this world-renowned animal communicator, through her live call-in show, will assist you in understanding animals as light beings, here to raise the vibrational level of this planet. They're ready. Are you Tune in each Wednesday at noon Eastern on TransformationTalkRadio.com for the hit show Out of the Fog with Karen Hager. Spark your spirit and ignite your soul with spiritual conversation and enlightening guests that'll help catapult you into action. You'll meet metaphysical movers and shakers and light workers guaranteed to raise your vibration. Karen's down-to-earth style and lively curiosity is what makes this show super special. Visit FogCityPsychic.com to find out more and to book your private intuitive reading today. There is not just one kind of radio show. Some shows are about health, wellness, food. Others are about helping you on your spiritual journey. Some radio shows are all about busting through and getting unstuck from the crust in your life. But the Dr. Pat Show? Well, she does it all. She's been helping people in all aspects of their life now for 10 years. Her interview style, her unique personality, the amazing guests she has on her show are all factors of what makes an amazing radio show. Please join Dr. Pat in celebrating 10 extraordinary years of talk radio. Hi, I'm Dr. Pat. Thank you for supporting us for the past 10 years. Positive Talk Radio was a vision that we've had. And thanks to all of you, you've helped us make it a reality. We are promising each and every one of you that this coming year, our 10th year anniversary, will be the best yet. 
For more information, please make sure you stay tuned to TransformationTalkRadio.com or the DrPatShow.com. And remember, join me. Let's live life full out together. Tune in each Wednesday at 1 p.m. Pacific Time, 4 Eastern Time on Transformation Talk Radio to Limelight Radio with Katina Macris. This is an inspirational, cutting-edge radio show educating worldwide listeners on a diversity of Lyme disease-related topics. Each week, Katina will interview some of the world's leaders in health, wellness, spirituality, and human potential. For more information, visit LimeLightRadio.com. You are listening to Transformation Talk Radio, the home of some of the world's most inspiring talk radio hosts. Please stay tuned at the top of the hour. We will be bringing you another amazing, educational, and inspiring show to get you on the path to transforming your life. For more information about us, please visit our website, www.transformationtalkradio.com. That's www.transformationtalkradio.com. 